How to unfreeze a bank account. Three tips. To date, there has never been such a big quantity of reported cases with suspicious money laundering activities in Switzerland. That's truly a new record. Swiss banks have reported 2,367 cases with suspicious activities last year. In the year 2015, 2,367 programs and accounts. In this video, you learn what you have to do if something goes wrong with your Swiss bank account. Such suspicious activities reports means frozen bank accounts. This automatically leads to frozen bank account. You know, it can happen to anybody. It can happen to you. with SwissBankingLawyers.com. In the last five years, we have defrozen 122 bank accounts. That means we have a large experience, a huge experience. You don't need to be a criminal to have your bank account frozen. It can happen to you very fast. Your account can remain frozen for years and years. You may never have access to your money again. This is the worst case scenario. The European Union, the FLTF, the OECD, the United States of America have criminalized Switzerland and many Swiss bankers. All these governmental and non-governmental organizations have accused Switzerland to hide money, to hide criminal money. You know, the times with Anonymous and the times with secret accounts are over, definitely over. Why can your bank account be frozen? Your bank account can be frozen if you do mistakes in the communication with your banks. If there is a misunderstanding, you know, one misplaced sentence can cause the bank to report your account and consequently freeze your account. If you have a negative sentiment on the situation with your Swiss bank, pick up the phone and call me immediately. First consultation is free of charge, as you know. Time is very important. To act fast is very important. If your payment execution is not done within two or maximum three days, this means red flag. Be very critical with what the bank is telling you. The IT system is not working. The banker had a car accident and is in the hospital. You know, all these excuses. The assistant made a mistake, your banker is in never-ending meetings and is refusing to, to speak with you, he's not reachable, this is a typical situation. If you hear these kind of stories, you can be 100% sure that bank has frozen your bank account. And the bank is lying to you. It's unbelievable but true. There is a period of six days the bank is forced by law to lie to you for a critical period of six days. Tip number one, now you have to be very calm and smart. Say nothing to the bank, say nothing to the bank. This is the most important tip. Do not communicate with your bank because in the communication you can make mistakes. This is my first most important advice. Do not communicate with your bank until you have a documentary evidence reflecting the economic background of your transaction. The risk to communicate wrongly is too high. You need to produce crystal clear arguments supported by documents. Collect everything you have. Collect all your invoices, agreements, correspondence, internal internet prints, all what you have regarding involved contracting parties. All documentation connected to the transaction must be collected and discussed with your lawyer. Tip number two. Appoint a lawyer with professional banking experience. This is very important. Tip number two, let your lawyer communicate with your, with your bank. Don't do it yourself. Let your lawyer communicate. 
Do not underestimate this problem. Let him communicate with the bank on your behalf. It's a good idea to have a lawyer between you and the bank. He will advise you exactly which documents you have to present and what you have to hide, what you have to say, and, you, and what you don't should say. Tip number three, don't tell short stories or modified stories to the bank. Don't lie. Do not underestimate the accuracy of the bank's memory. Do not underestimate your bank's memory. Why? They have today, these days, they have a new army. They have a new army of compliance officers, an army of forensic experts, and all these people. They all investigate the economic background. They record everything that you sent to the bank or everything you tell to the bank. Not telling the same story can be the biggest mistake you can make. Be consistent. Your wealth is in danger. You need professional support. Do not try to solve this situation alone. That's the wrong approach. It can end in a financial disaster. You can lose all your money. In case you have a bad feeling with your bank account or in case you have a frozen account, pick up the phone immediately and call me. Dial 0041442124404 and speak with me immediately at any time. You can call me at any time because in this case, time is essential, time is crucial. The first case evaluation is free of charge, as you know. Be rich and remain rich. Have a wonderful day.